and we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create triangles. There are many ways to do it, let me first create a new layer. I'm going to call it triangles and I use transparency. I confirm it and I make sure that I've got it active so that I draw on it. You can basically use the drawing tools right here. Let me use for example the paintbrush. I use one pixel just like this and I hold shift. So left click, hold shift and you see these indicator lines, left click again, close the shape. Same goes for the pencil, but you can see you won't get perfect triangles. So they have more this hand drawn, let's say characteristic. You can use guides to help you out a little bit. By default, if you hover over these lines, you should see a little bit of a snapping occurring. Let me make this a bit bigger and you can see it properly. So if I reach the guide, this snaps. And again, I hold shift. And it looks much better but it's still not a perfect triangle. You can use more guides and try to have a good eye for it. And then you can create something like this. But I believe that the best way is to let me press Ctrl Z to get rid of it all. Then I go to view and I check this box, show grid. And I also need snap to grid. So once again view, activate this box, use one of these drawing tools, for example the pencil, zoom in, I size it down a little bit, and the snapping helps me, I simply left click, I go up diagonally and now I count these boxes. So it's 8 from left to center, so I need 8 from center to right. Left click, I hold shift and I close this. And now we've got a perfect triangle. So this is the way I would do it. You can color it by dragging this swatch into it. If that doesn't work, just use the bucket fill tool. Left click on it. If you want to change the color, click on this icon, make it for example red. Left click again and now our triangle is red. Go to view, uncheck the box for show grid. And this is how you can create triangles in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.